All right, thanks everyone uh, for joining us today. Really appreciate uh, your time. Uh, my name is Dave Emberley. I'm the Territory Manager, Manager for Southwestern Ontario, Canada. Uh, I've been with ABK for eight years. And like Ann said, uh, at the end of the presentation, uh, we'll have some questions uh, for a giveaway. And we'll also uh, have uh, time for you guys to ask any questions about the product. Uh, I have people online that, uh, that will know the answers uh, to it. Uh, today we're going to talk about the features and benefits of the Series 766 uh, Butterfly Valve. All ABK products are manufactured in Minden, Nevada on our uh, ISO 9001 and 14001. The 9001 is our quality control. Uh, 14,001 is our environmental control. As you can see here, uh, the double eccentric uh, butterfly valve uh, was specially uh, developed for the North American market. Our product range is 24 inch through to 48 inch. So you can see these are large diameter valves, uh, but we do have the smaller ones in our series uh, 816. The main function of the butterfly valve is to uh, shut off the flow of water. The 766 does uh, meet and exceed the AWW C504, uh, the C5550 as well. We are certified NSF 61 and 372 for the Safe Drinking uh, Water Act. The testing you can see here, uh, we do 30, 36 inch valves at 5,000 cycles. We do 48 inch uh, at 1,000 cycles. Uh, we do this with a 250 PSI of unbalanced pressure. So that really puts a lot of torque uh, on the actual valve. And the 766 uh, had no issues or leaks uh, when we uh, ran them through these tests. The double eccentric design, uh, it means it has two offsets. So the offset is up or downstream. It also uh, slightly has an offset towards the uh, pipe sidewall. The advantages of this uh, is you get lower seat wear. And when the valve is fully open, there is absolutely no stress on the actual rubber seat. The valves uh, do have a preferred direction. Uh, but if you do want bi-directional, you, you definitely have to uh, ask for that because uh, we do the necessary testing for that. Uh, we do have an arrow on the actual valve that tells you the direction of flow. It's not actually pressure, the side of the pressure of the disc. And it's very important that uh, you install the, um, the valves in the right direction. What's very cool about our design and the MJ version is we do not have to bevel the pipes uh, for uh, disc clearance. And uh, a lot of our competitors, you have to do that to, to use their valves. You actually have to uh, bevel the pipes, where ABKs, you don't. Uh, and again, we're saving you time and money uh, in the field. Another cool uh, aspect of our valve is the analog. Uh, what we do is we drill and tap uh, into the uh, feet of the valve. And this gives it a carthotic uh, protection, uh, which eliminates any welding that goes on to the body of the valve, which would uh, introduce uh, points of corrosion. Um, so we eliminate that for you. The disc is a flow through design. As you can see here on the picture, the massive openings uh, on the disc. Uh, what that does, it lowers, our head, it lowers your head loss uh, when the water's through, flowing through the actual disc. And uh, it stiffens up the strength of the disc as well, but not increasing the weight. So it's a more efficient uh, design. The materials that we use for the valve, it, uh, valve body and the disc are ductile iron. The uh, ABK Series 766 is a seat on disc design. Uh, the seats uh, are field repairable. We do this by either injecting epoxy in behind the seat or actually replacing the seat uh, completely. Uh, the rubber seals on the discs are EPDM rubber, uh, but MBR is uh, available. 
So the stems of the class 150 valves are 431 stainless steel. Uh, the stems for the class 250 are 17.4 pH stainless steel. And what this does is it gives our valves extreme closing strength. Uh, again, with these larger diameters, you are putting a lot of force on, uh, on the design. The stem seals are MBR and all the hardware in our, uh, our valves are 316 stainless. The seat in the valve body is uh, 316 stainless steel. Uh, the seat has an O-ring backing, which prevents water from leaking through one side of the uh, body, uh, body seat into the other. The seat seals uh, by uh, four O-rings, which are MBR. We have uh, two interior and two exterior O-rings that are mounted with uh, bronze uh, O-ring cartridges. Uh, these stems, uh, stem seals are replaceable without removing or disassembling the actual valve in the line, which is another great benefit for you. ABK Series 766 uh, is designed to prevent uh, water from entering the stem uh, area of the disc and the valve body. As you can see on the picture on the left, uh, there's an O-ring where the stem enters the disc to prevent water from entering. Uh, the center here, uh, we have uh, an O-ring cartridge at the top and at the bottom of that uh, valve body uh, to, to seal the water from entering in. The interior of the hub, which is the uh, far right, uh, the valve body is sealed by, with O-rings as well. And what this does is it prevents uh, corrosion from occurring inside the actual disc and weakening the uh, pins that actually operate as you can see here, the pins uh, on the far right that actually operate the valve. The, uh, the disc is retained by the stem, stainless steel uh, pins, and a backup key as well. Uh, the pins are covered uh, by O-rings to protect uh, each pin. Uh, we use a stainless steel plate and rubber gasket for this. This uh, sealing system uh, for the pin area protects uh, the hub and the disc area from any water getting into it, uh, ensuring that the uh, connection to the pins are secure. The upper and lower stems are supported by a uh, PTFE coated steel bearing and also supported by an actual bearing. So again, we're using uh, technology to uh, make your life a lot easier out in the field there. Um, ABK Series 766, again, our full product range is 24 inch to 48 inch. Uh, the end connections through the full range are either flange by flange or MJ by MJ. The pressure classes we have are 150B or 250B. Uh, the B stands for the flow um, velocity, and these are rated up to 16 feet uh, per second. Again, if you do need bi-directional, uh, you have to ask for that. Accessories. Uh, for the Series 766 Butterfly Valve, we have uh, traveling uh, nut gear boxes, worm gears, and uh, electric motor operators. Uh, we also develop uh, accessories such as uh, extension stands, pneumatic operators, ground leveling position indicators, and uh, we have different colors as well. The valve comes with a uh, one-year warranty. And uh, if you do have an issue, just reach out, to, uh, you know, check our website, reach out to the TM that uh, services your area, and uh, they will be happy to look after you. Here we have the next few slides actually are uh, our valves being used um, in the system. As you can see, these things are massive. So this brings us to uh, our website. Make sure you visit uh, ABK Support. And what's great about that is the information on our products. You can take a virtual tour of our manufacturing facilities. Uh, you can download uh, data sheets, watch install and maintenance videos, and even uh, view brochures. We also, like Ann said at the beginning, uh, we have a great YouTube channel, which has a ton of information as well. And uh, we have a training program uh, which has over 50 courses 
which will make uh, make you ABK certified and it's free. So here's my contact information on the last slide. And what's great about the AVK butterfly valve is we've done the testings, we have the materials in them that they don't leak. And that's the biggest uh, issue out in the field for butterfly valve is that they leak when they're closed. And with AVK's design materials and testing, you're definitely putting a superior product in your system. So uh, I just want to, um, you know, tell everybody uh, we've done that we've done the homework to make sure that you have the right product in your in your line so again I appreciate everybody's uh, time today and hopefully you learned a little bit uh, about uh, our butterfly valve and uh, like I said visit our website uh, there's tons of information on there as well and contact information for a territory manager that will be more than happy to help you out